welcome back to My Wife Plays The Illusion of Gaia, Episode 2. Woo. So the last time we were here, I got um, two red jewels, and I talked to, to everyone in the South Cape town, I think it is. Yep. And so now, here we go. Here we're, we're going to continue the story. Okay, South Cape. And I'll just go this way. Do you have those jewels on you? Uh, I think I put them in last. Did you? La yeah, before oh. I saved. Pretty sure, anyway. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you did. Perfect. Yeah. So, we're good. Alright. So, now that we've explored the entire town, let's, uh... He moved. He did move. Even if I move to another place, I can't pull it up. <laughs> All right then. Try. Well, let's do. Yeah. Continue. Uh, we'll worry about that in just a little bit. He's the. He's the guy that has the RNG jewel. Oh. That I told you about. Yeah. It was natural for the four friends to call this seaside cave their second home. Usually, when lessons were done at the school. They gathered there, there to talk and play games until sundown. What is it, Will? It's late. I'm playing cards with Seth. Wait a minute. Ha ha ha, I'm going to win again for sure. Suddenly, Eric rushed in with a desperate look on his face. Ah, news! Big news! The princess of Edward Castle has run away! They say she came to South Cape! That's all? You came in such a hurry that I thought something really big had happened. The princess is probably that spoiled gar girl, Kara. The one you like so much. Liar! Maybe the soldiers will come lo here looking for her. The soldiers from Edward Castle look so cool. I want to steal Helmet too. And they proceed to ignore him. Okie dokie. <laughs> I'm not interested in girls. I like adventures better. We'll get over here and sit next to Eric. And I thought everyone would be surprised. Everyone's here. What should we do today? I want to see Will, Will's mysterious power. You haven't seen it? He can move things without touching them. He moved the statue that's in the corner of the cave. Will, show me again. Uh, how? What? How do I? I don't... You're, I'm not equipped. I don't know what I'm doing. There's a couple of buttons you haven't touched yet. Oh, wait, hold on. I'm so confused. <laughs> Get on the other side of the rocks. What? Stand up against the table. Oh, uh, this. And then, wait, which table? This table? Yeah, the big table. Now. Oh, it moved! Now you can. Now I can go back to the table? Talk to him. Next, pick a card, any card. I'll put four cards face down. Pick the one you think is the Ace of Diamonds. Don't get it wrong. What? Eh? How? Pick the one you think is the Ace of Diamonds. How am I supposed to know? I don't know. I'll guess this one. Will picks up a card. It is the Ace of Diamonds, of course. I got it right! <laughs> it would have been any card, yes, I think. It would have. <laughs> <laughs> ah, right! I'm speechless. Hey, Seth, this is some type of psychic power, right? <clears throat> yeah, it must be some kind of psychic power thing. <clears throat> if I didn't know any better, if I didn't know better, I'd think it was magic. Most people have five senses sight, hearing, taste, smell, and touch. I think Will's psychic power is some kind of sixth, sixth sense. Mm -hmm. He sees dead people. My wife What's... doesn't get that reference. No. What Seth says is too complicated for me to understand. Seth, let's play one more game. Okie dokie. Uh -huh, I'm going to win again for sure. One more game with Seth and I'm going home. Quitter. If I could only do that.
right? I like the way I'm sitting. Is that it? Yeah. All right. Yeah, that would have. It doesn't matter which card you pick. He's gonna. It's gonna be the Ace of Diamonds every time. I just wanted to say that to tease you. All right, now go in and out. It is already dark by the time we left the cave. Wait. Go in and out until the fisherman is right below you. Okay. What? That was scary. I almost missed yeah. it. He lifted the strange teapot. You found a red jewel. Cool. There you go. That's it? Yeah, that's okay. it. It came very fast for you. Sometimes I'm going in and out like a hundred times before he shows up. And... Oh, hold on. I can go like... Of course, I'm probably exaggerating. I'm not equipped. Hold on. Um, wait, how do I equip it? Items. Items? There you go. Okay. Now it says you're equipped. Okay, and then I use it by pushing... I raise the red jewel and it flies. Okay. I did it! I figured it out! <laughs> now, do you remember how you did that? Because that's how you use herbs in the game. I push... I push the select button. Yep. And then I click on items and then I clicked on I clicked A yeah. to equip it. Okay. And then I pushed B to get out of there. And then I rate I did B to use the item that I equipped. Alright. And so I did it. I'm Good learning. Job. I am learning this game. <clears throat> on top of it. Wait, was that a new guy? Hold on. Do I need to talk to people again? Always talk to people. But no, not again. I'm good. I can leave. Yeah, you're good. Other than uh, Bill and Lola, I believe. Um, hold on. I want to save the game again since I've found another jewel and I got through a cutscene and whatnot. Yeah. I feel like I should save the game. No, you don't feel like it. <laughs> Finish recording. I'll continue on my journey. Then go. All right. Now I'm going to go talk to my grandparents, Lola and Bill. We had a bit of technical difficulties while recording this episode. So we decided to restart it. Yeah. I mean, it was only like two, three minutes in, thankfully, but... Yeah. So, yeah, the, it kind of, uh... The screen it, went black. Yeah, it went haywire <laughs> but, on us. So... What? Where's the pig? Where did the pig come from? The, the pig's, pig's right wrecking there. the... I know. But it, why is there a pig in my house? Oink, oink. Bill? Lola? Where are you? I'm so... what? Hamlet, you shouldn't snort at strangers. Is this your house? Yeah. So? Frankly, you look a little shabby. Well, excuse me. Your father, mother, not here, huh? My parents are dead. Is this a picture of your parents? My father's an explorer. He... I know. Omen the Explorer. They say he was lost. He'll come back someday. Are you sad? No. I'd be sad if it were me. I'm sorry. Anyway, is there a piano here? No, there isn't. But Grandma Lola is a great singer. They're singing upstairs now. They have such loud voices. I don't think that's a compliment. <laughs> okay. Oink, oink. Hamlet's the best character. I like how Will actually has things that he's saying. Yeah, right? He's not a silent protagonist. Yeah. Welcome home, Will. When I sing opera, I lose track of the time. Dinner's not ready yet. Why aren't you making dinner? Why are you singing? Oh my, I haven't sung like this in a long time. Your grandmother, Lola, used to be a singer. I fell in love with her voice. That's why I married her. <laughs> oh, you, bringing up a thing like that. Will, you shouldn't be surprised to hear that. The girl who was singing with me a minute ago. No! A scream from downstairs. It's that girl screaming! I guess I'll go down too. Oh. The soldiers have come to take her. Princess, I've been looking for you. I don't know you. Be gone. What are you saying? If I don't take you home, I'll lose my head. Question mark. I'll lose my head? 
What do I care if you lose your head? Princess? Do you think I have nothing better to do than chase you down? I must take you home. It's the king's orders. He's dragging her. Yeah? I'm sorry I lied to you. I'm King Edward's daughter, Cara. Well, I feel as though we've met before, as if we're good friends. As if we were good friends. Okay. I'm confused. <laughs> they just sit down like nothing happened. So that girl likes to play practical jokes. <laughs> okay. Edward Castle. There's a big viaduct. Viaduct under the castle. Your grandfather designed it. What? Really? I used to be an architect. There's a prison under the castle. It's built like a maze to keep the prisoners from escaping. I feel bad that I built a prison where people disappear and are never heard from again. Like Will's father. Mm -hmm. Enough serious talk. Let's eat dinner. I've made a delicious pie. Let's sit at the table upstairs. Okay. I guess we're going to... Will, do you think Lola's meals have been a little strange lately? Last night, licorice and rice. Before that, mouse fritters. I can't stand it anymore. Sometimes old people, if they're surrounded by problems, get a little forgetful. Maybe there's something bothering her that she can't talk about. Uh, be careful when going upstairs. Don't. I think it's gonna be another text box thing. Okay. So be careful going upstairs. Got it. Careful. I'm not touching anything. We sat down to a feast of snail pie with whipped cream. Yummy. Oh, disgusting. <laughs> I only got one piece, but Grandpa Bill ate half the pie. After he was just complaining about the food. I mean, he is. He is the husband, though. I mean, that, that is... <laughs> yeah, you, you have a fair point. Is that not what husbands are supposed to do? <laughs> that is what the husbando do. <laughs> that night, Will dreamed that Cara and he took a trip around the world. Except I learned not to complain about my wife's food. And the next morning, something began to happen. Didn't I? What? What did you say? I was reading! <laughs> <laughs> I said, except I learned not to complain about my wife's food. Yep. After, like, the first meal. <sighs> I'm a good cook. You make delicious meals. Sometimes I don't know if I should believe them. <laughs> good morning, Will. I mean, a letter has come for you from King Edward. This is what is written in the letter. Bring the crystal ring from Olma's things to Edward Castle, King Edward. I've been in a bad mood ever since I saw this letter. Oh, Will, I'll teach you a spell. When I'm upset, <laughs> humming this tune makes me feel better. Lola hummed a strange melody. Did I just learn a spell? That's pretty. Even though Will had never heard it before, it seemed oddly familiar. I do hate the the text crawl. You've learned Lola's melody. Yay! Good job. I did something. I learned something, guys. A crystal ring? Never heard of it. There was nothing like that in the luggage your father Olman left behind. Maybe we could go to Edward Castle. We could see the princess. <laughs> <laughs> Be careful. Okie dokie. I do I have to go look for this ring now? Nope. Okay. You have to go to the castle. Oh my gosh. Okay, I feel like I should save the game and finish here though. Alright. Pick back up on the next episode. Yeah, <clears throat> that sounds good. As we leave the town of South Cape for the very first time. Hmm. Alrighty, two episodes and I'm still in South Cape. That's okay. <laughs> Record. Well, Finish we are recording. opting to go with shorter video times. So that's true. I think that's bound to happen. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you guys for joining us. All right. Bye. Bye. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like.
comment, share, subscribe, and... Hit that notification bell. That way you can join us next time. Bye! Bye.